Alright, hello everyone, this is Jaxus and Shy. Here to commentate Tuin versus G-Man. First match of oh, I didn't update that. The first match of Top 8. Oh, well, there we go. Anyways, this is looking pretty close. Both characters uh, with G-Man's custom upbeat have crazy kill potential on their own. Oh, hype kick! <laughs> That was a very nice flip kick. Oh, Definitely. No! And gets up there oh. immediately. <laughs> but, you know, it's still Diddy, so whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and with that, we are at one stock even. And then G-Man gets a banana and 34%, 40%, <laughs> 56%. <laughs> um, Tuin looks like he's gonna need to kind of regain his footing. Okay, that, that planked and won. That's a good back on too, in part, though. Yeah, definitely. Ooh, good Ooh. up air catch up air? flip kick. Yep. Um, I think G-Man, if he catches two in on anything right now, to okay. do that, that would kill. Oop. Nope. No punish, though. On either part. <laughs> Whipping those grabs and punishes right there. Both care. Players. Mm. Good forward smash. Ooh! Alright, Spike isn't strong enough to kill there. He's not that, that, that high up. Yeah. Go forward air. I think he went for the hype kick. I think both characters have to be very careful with their upbeat. Yep! But, but two and will take game one. I feel like G-Man is gonna you know, every time he lost to say at least Diddy, he switched even against you, he switched to Ganon. Yeah. His Ganon is actually really fairly well today. Yeah. But it has. What do you think the stage choices are gonna be right now? It really depends on who G-Man is trying to be, but I'm going to assume he's going to take off TNC, Halberd, and Orville, you know? Like, two of the three. TSS is standing. You're right. I'm TSS copy. Apparently we're going to Omega Orville Gate Assault. Interesting. And G-Man is staying Diddy. Yeah. Diddy isn't doing bad today, I think he's just... All of his games haven't even been bad, they've just all been really close. Yeah. He's been getting some serious work off of the uh, banana. Yeah. Oh Diddy has my really good god. He's, he just like his after the patch though, Diddy, there. you're able to see all the combos he can do out of down throw besides just up air. Yeah. Because he no, can go. His up air does now combo way longer. Yeah, he can go up air to back air to back air. Mm -hmm. So depending how he rethink and through that. I think I would stay down when the paralyzer was coming and then move up or he just got up. Um, I think it might actually hit people on the ground. The paralyzer also actually has less ending lag if it's fully charged before you release it. Yeah. It's not massive, but it's oh, no. definitely the You can go sideways with that, by the way. Oh, he didn't. Okay. You can go sideways with it. It's just very hard to control. It's, you can't go very far sideways with it. Oh, he fell out of the second hit, and then Tuin ended up uh, footstooling off of him, so he couldn't actually follow anything up. What's with the back air misses? Yeah, just barely. It's forward tilt. 
goes to the up. Oh, we catch up with the down smash. Doesn't quite catch him, but luckily for him, down smash is safe on shield. Goes for up, down throw up air. Classic Diddy. Yep. Oh. Alright, he's at single use of banana. Banana to oh, I kill. No, I, I think VSS was too low percent to, for that to kill. Yeah, not by much though. Good banana to forward smash, oh. and that one killed. That one killed? Okay. That one was that was interesting to me too. I saw that one kills. It is Diddy with range. Yeah. 130 range is not anything best with Diddy. Uh, two seems to be flip kicking, like doing the actual okay, back air. kick onto shields quite a bit. Um, and I think G-Man's starting to catch on to that and punish it, which could be bad. Going for the read of the roll from the back air. Yeah. Two did not let that happen. They're very good for this. He's juggling two very well right now. Oh. That. Yeah, that, it's not the strongest of punishes, but I mean, hey, he got the percent. That's what he's going for right now. At this point, wall uh, percents are definitely skewed in Diddy's favor. VSS uh, can CSS. get one combo and kill Diddy. Yeah, she has the Ganon factor. Well, he almost ledge canceled that, which I think is what he was going for, but he just barely didn't get it. What up B, though, from Diddy right now? Ooh, very good yeah, he on. has the crazy up B as well. Yes. Very good up air. Very close game right now. Yeah. Oh, oh right there, it's messed up. Both of them did not whip their forward smash up there right there at that time. But it's banana the other way. Yeah, and two and like I'm not even gonna touch this and just rolls back. She's trying to pick Ooh, very good whip and oh. up there. No! Oh, no. That's game. No. That's game. No. Yeah. Just no. punish with the forward smash. Oh. <laughs> very close game. This is a boost kick and got punished very hard for it. Yeah. Boost kick. If he'd gone for the boost kick um, instead of the up air at the start, he I probably would have gone out. But that's just so hard to react to. <laughs> so, going to game three. Yep. I'm going to be on commentary all this whole time. Okay. Uh, so yeah, you were just barely outside of it. I played terribly today, I don't deserve this top. Anyways, oh, looks like G-Man is indeed pulling out Ganon. Interesting. Yep, he just and won his... Though, right? he because that was incredibly close. True. And so far, Ganon's been doing better for him than Diddy. Oh, Alright, here we go. Ganon versus ESS. I don't know how to feel about the you know. I think this is a bad choice for low. I think uh, this is a really it. good stage for ZSS because the low blast zone is down through to up air, up air, they're dead. Harry put it on top. The G Man reads anything right, you get it as well. Yeah. Very good. But I feel like it's easier for ZSS to good get her stuff than Ganon. Oh. Good down tilt. Keep punishing very hard right now. Yeah, definitely. Ganon, I think, needs huh? one big hit. I think she's sure. starting to figure out that, um, G-Man's punishing him for the flip kicks because he's strong. Oh! kick. Yeah, he's oh, 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 That hit right. <laughs> that was <laughs> interesting. Hit. Yeah. Very good drop kicks on G-Man, though. Killing with the drop kick there very early, too. Mm -hmm. Um, normal boost kick Ooh, does very good that boost kick. pretty well. And but. Or Wizard's Float, sorry. But the drop kick has such a good angle. Oh, it, it's, it's a recovery move, yeah. Um, it loses the vast majority of its kill power, but I mean, it just it killed right kills. there. <laughs> yep. Ganon, it is still Ganon. If Ganon gets in range, though. Oh, very sure, good back okay. What? <laughs> I don't even know. These kills are very interesting. Ganon? Interesting. Oh, no, he's good. He's, he's good. He's good. <laughs> I was about to say, okay, why, why is he fit and shield? Why not just go black and go to jump over? Actually, he's dead. Never mind. Oh, very interesting. He hit the shield, but he didn't have any way to really punish yeah, that. Yeah, and outside of maybe an up air, I don't think anything in his kick could have hit there. Very good oh, grab oh. oh, Ooh, very good tear. <laughs> I think two is very scared of this game. Yeah, but on the other hand, G-Man has to be. Why is he keep going for the boost kick? 
Um, because if you read their DI, down throw to boost kick is a true combo. It's just you have to read their DI. Very good. Um, very close to a good wizard's drop kick. To up it. No. Yeah, up air kill! Okay. You respect it. That was great. Oh. That was great. Alright. <laughs> it just kind of bounced off. Yeah, man, the cosmic is true. Yep. So it looks like next up is going to be uh, me versus that guy, actually. So I think